Hi, welcome to another episode of This Is Anything Goes. So today I'm going to show you how to install a um, child carrier or baby carrier seat at the back of a bicycle. Okay, so this is what I purchased from Shopee. Alright, it comes with four plastic pieces. This is the handle. This two is the feet guard and the main unit itself. Alright, and then we have the cushion padding and a bunch of hardware. And then the tools that we need is a Phillips screwdriver and a 10 mm spanner. Alright, open wrench. Okay, so let's get to it. Okay, so the first thing we want to install is the legs here first. Alright, so I'm going to show you how to do it once on one side. Okay, so once you have it like this, what you do is put in a nut here and put in a nut on the bottom here as well. Alright, so China made products, so you can't really see the hole, just punch it a bit. Okay, and what you do now is you need to bolt it up. Here and also over here. So there's no need for any washers or anything since these are all soft plastics. Alright. Okay, so what you need to do now is take your wrench, hold it, alright, so that it doesn't move around, and use your Phillips screwdriver and tighten it. There you have it. One side done, now let's do the other side. Okay, now that we have both the um, leg guard here, what we need to do is the handle. Alright, the handle is fairly simple. If you see the two nudges over here, alright, if you see the two nudges over here, it goes into here and here. Then you put the bolt on the top. Alright, so far we have, we have been using this uh, sharp bolts only, okay? Alright, these two bolts actually goes on the bottom. Sorry, these two nuts, uh, sorry, um, bolts, yeah, bolts, go on the bottom. And the nut goes on top. Alright, like this. Then this goes from the bottom. Okay, so once you're at this stage, just put the nut in, use a screwdriver and tighten it. Okay, so once you have both of it in, it'll be like this, and then we'll move on to the seats, okay? So what you need to do is lay it up like this, okay? There's two holes here, so you have to go through the holes. Alright, so let's puncture the hole first. Alright, just puncture it with the Phillips screwdriver as well. Okay, so since it's already pre-cut, so the hole will be perfect. Okay, now we'll be using the long bolts. Okay, make sure the seat belts are all on the top. So we'll put this in, and we'll put this in. Okay, then we'll move to the bicycle. Okay, so we'll be putting the seat on the back here. Make sure you have this rack, else you, 
this thing just wouldn't fit anywhere all right okay so with the four um, screws on the bottom here we are going to position it and then we're going to lock it with the two brackets that's given these two brackets okay so the long one will be on the front the short one will be on the back all right Okay, so the next thing you need to do before you tighten it fully is that you have to make sure that it is more or less aligned and straight to the bicycle. Alright, so one way to do it is align it to your seat, middle to middle. Okay, once that's done, then what you do is you tighten all four of these. One, two, three, four. Okay, then we are done. Okay, so once you have tightened it, make sure you test. Alright. Okay, it's not moving anywhere, that's good. No left, right, no front, back. Okay? So this is that. Yep.